Rhenium is a chemical element with symbol Re and atomic number 75. It is a silvery white, heavy, third row transition metal in group 7 of the periodic table. With an estimated average concentration of one part per billion, rhenium is one of the rarest elements in the Earth's crust. The free element has the third highest melting point and highest boiling point of any element. Rhenium resembles manganese and technetium chemically and is obtained as a byproduct of molybdenum and copper ores extraction and refinement. Rhenium shows in its compounds a wide variety of oxidation states ranging from a 1 to plus 7. Discovered in 1925, rhenium was the last stable element to be discovered. It was named after the River Rhine in Europe. Nickel-based superalloys of rhenium are used in the combustion chambers, turbine blades, and exhaust nozzles of jet engines. These alloys contain up to 6% rhenium, making jet engine construction the largest single use for the element, with the chemical industry's catalytic uses being next most important. Because of the low availability relative to demand, rhenium is among the most expensive of metals, with an average price of approximately $4,575 per kilogram as of August 2011. It is also of critical strategic military importance, for its use in high-performance military jet and rocket engines. History, rhenium was the last element to be discovered having a stable isotope. The existence of a yet undiscovered element at this position in the periodic table had been first predicted by Dmitry Mendeleev. Other calculated information was obtained by Henry Moseley in 1914. It is generally considered to have been discovered by Walter Nodak, Ida Tack, and Otto Berg in Germany. In 1925 they reported that they detected the element in platinum ore and in the mineral columet. They also found rhenium in gadolinite and molybdenite. In 1928 they were able to extract 1 g of the element by processing 660 a kg of molybdenite. It was estimated in 1968 that 75% of the rhenium metal in the United States was used for research in the development of refractory metal alloys. It took several years from that point on before the superalloys became widely used. In 1908, Japanese chemist Masataka Ogawa announced that he discovered the 43rd element and named it Nipponium after Japan. However, later analysis indicated the presence of rhenium, not element 43. The symbol NP was later used for the element Neptunium. Characteristics Rhenium is a silvery white metal with one of the highest melting points of all elements, exceeded by only tungsten and carbon. It also has the highest boiling point of all elements. It is also one of the densest, exceeded only by platinum, iridium and osmium. Rhenium has a hexagonal close-packed crystal structure, with lattice parameters OR equals A276.1 APM and CHI equals A445.6 APM. Its usual commercial form is a powder, but this element can be consolidated by pressing and sintering in a vacuum or hydrogen atmosphere. This procedure yields a compact solid having a density above 90% of the density of the metal. When annealed this metal is very ductile and can be bent, coiled, or rolled. Rhenium molybdenum alloys are superconductive at 10 K. Tungsten rhenium alloys are also superconductive around 4 Euro 8 K, depending on the alloy. Rhenium metal superconducts at 1.697 a plus or minus 0.006 K. In bulk form and at room temperature and atmospheric pressure, the element resists alkalis, sulfuric acid, hydrochloric acid, dilute, but not concentrated nitric acid, and aqua regia. Isotopes Rhenium has one stable isotope, rhenium-185, which nevertheless occurs in minority abundance, a situation found only in two other elements. Naturally occurring rhenium is 37.4% 185Re, which is stable, and 62.6% 187Re, which is unstable but has a very long half-life. This lifetime can be greatly affected by the charged state of rhenium atom. The beta decay of 187Re is used for rhenium-osmium dating of ores. The available energy for this beta decay is one of the lowest known among all radionuclides. 
The isotope rhenium-186m is notable as being one of the longest-lived metastable isotopes with a half-life of around 200,000 years. There are 25 other recognized radioactive isotopes of rhenium. Compounds Rhenium compounds are known for all the oxidation states between a 3 and plus 7 except a 2. The oxidation states plus 7, plus 6, plus 4, and plus 2 are the most common. Rhenium is most available commercially as salts of perronate, including sodium and ammonium perronates. These are white, water-soluble compounds. Halides and oxhalides, the most common rhenium chlorides are ReCl6, ReCl5, ReCl4, and ReCl3. The structures of these compounds often feature extensive re-rebonding, which is characteristic of this metal in oxidation states lower than 7. Salts of Re2Cl8, 2 feature a quadruple metal metal bond. Although the highest rhenium chloride features Re, 6, fluorine gives the DO Re, 7, derivative rhenium heptafluoride. Bromides and iodides of rhenium are also well known. Like tungsten and molybdenum, with which it shares chemical similarities, rhenium forms a variety of oxhalides. The oxychlorides are most common, and include ReOCl4, ReO3Cl. Oxides and sulfides. The most common oxide is the volatile colorless Re2O7, which adopts a molecular structure, unlike most metal oxides. The D1 species Rio3 adopts a defect provskite structure. Other oxides include Re2O5. Rio 2 and Re 2 3 The sulfides are Re S2 and Re 2 S7. Perinate salts can be converted to tetraethylperinate by the action of ammonium hydrosulfide. Other compounds, rhenium diboride is a hard compound having the hardness similar to that of tungsten carbide, silicon carbide, titanium diboride or zirconium diboride. Again, ahenium compounds. Dehenium decacarbonyl is the most common entry to aganahenium chemistry. Its reduction with sodium amalgam gives Na, Re, company, 5, with rhenium in the formal oxidation state A1. Dehenium decacarbonyl can be oxidized with bromine to bromopin to carbonyl in a UM, I, Re2, CO, 10 plus Br2 or 2 Re, company, 5 Br. Reduction of this pentacarbonyl with zinc and acetic acid gives pentacarbonyl hydridarenium, Re, company, 5Br plus Zn plus Hoka Re, company, 5 hours plus ZnBr, oak, methylenium trioxide, CH3 Rio 3 is a volatile, colorless solid has been used as a catalyst in some laboratory experiments. It can be prepared by many routes, a typical method is the reaction of Re207 and tetramethyltin. Re207 plus 4SN a CH3 Re03 plus 3SN or O3, analogous orcal and aryl derivatives are known. MTO catalyzes for the oxidations with hydrogen peroxide. Terminal orcans yield the corresponding acid or ester, internal orcans yield dictones, and alkanes give epoxides. MTO also catalyzes the conversion of aldehydes and diazolcanes into an alkan. non orhydridronate a distinctive derivative of rhenium is non-orhydridronate, originally thought to be the re anion, re, but actually containing the re h 2 a 9 anion in which the oxidation state of rhenium is plus 7. Occurrence Rhenium is one of the rarest elements in Earth's crust with an average concentration of 1 a ppb. Other sources quote the number of 0.5 a ppb making it the 77th most abundant element in Earth's crust. Rhenium is probably not found free in nature, but occurs in amounts up to 0.2% in the mineral molybdenite, the major commercial source, although single molybdenite samples with up to 1.88% have been found. Chile has the world's largest rhenium reserves, part of the copper ore deposits, and was the leading producer as of 2005. It was only recently that the first rhenium mineral was found and described, a rhenium sulfide mineral condensing from a fumarole on Russia's Kudryvy volcano, Ichurup Island, in the Kuril Islands. Kudryavy discharges up to 20 a euro 60 a kg rhenium per year mostly in the form of rhenium disulfide. Named rheniite, this rare mineral commands high prices among collectors. Production 
commercial rhenium is extracted from molybdenum roast of flue gas obtained from copper sulfide ores. Some molybdenum ores contain 0.001% to 0.2% rhenium. Rhenium, 7, oxide and perhenic acid readily dissolve in water. They are leached from flue dusts and gases and extracted by precipitating with potassium or ammonium chloride as the perinate salts, and purified by recrystallization. Total world production is between 40 and 50 tons a year. The main producers are in Chile, the United States, Peru, and Poland. Recycling of used PT recatalyst and special alloys allow the recovery of another 10 tons per year. Prices for the metal rose rapidly in early 2008, from $1,000 a euro $2,000 per kg in 2003 a euro 2006 to over $10,000 in February 2008. The metal form is prepared by reducing ammonium perinate with hydrogen at high temperatures, 2NH4 Rio 4 plus 7 hours 2 or 2 Re plus 8 hours 2 O plus 2NH3. Applications Rhenium is added to high temperature super alloys that are used to make jet engine parts, using 70% of the worldwide rhenium production. Another major application is in platinum rhenium catalysts, which are primarily used in making lead free, high octane gasoline. Alloys the nickel based super alloys have improved creep strength with the addition of rhenium. The alloys normally contain 3% or 6% of rhenium. Second generation alloys contain 3%. These alloys were used in the engines of the F 16 and F 15, while the newer single crystal third generation alloys contain 6% of rhenium. They are used in the F 22 and F 35 engines. Rhenium is also used in the super alloys, such as CMSX4 and CMSX10 that are used in industrial gas turbine engines like the GE7FA. Rhenium can cause super alloys to become microstructurally unstable, forming undesirable TCP phases. In fourth and fifth generation super alloys, ruthenium is used to avoid this effect. Among others the new super alloys are EPM102 and TMS162 both containing 6% rhenium, as well as TMS-138 and TMS-174. For 2006, the consumption is given as 28% for General Electric, 28% Rolls-Royce PLC and 12% Pratt & Whitney, all for superalloys, while the use for catalysts only accounts for 14% and the remaining applications use 18%. In 2006, 77% of the rhenium consumption in the United States was in alloys. The rising demand for military jet engines and the constant supply made it necessary to develop superalloys with a lower rhenium content. For example the newer CFM International CFM 56 high pressure turbine blades will use REN AN515 with a rhenium content of 1.5% instead of REN AN5 with 3%. Rhenium improves the properties of tungsten. Tungsten rhenium alloys are more ductile at low temperature, allowing them to be more easily machined. The high temperature stability is also improved. The effect increases with the rhenium concentration, and therefore tungsten alloys are produced with up to 27% of Re, which is the solubility limit. One application for the tungsten rhenium alloys is X-ray sources. The high melting point of both compounds, together with the high atomic mass, makes them stable against the prolonged electron impact. Rhenium tungsten alloys are also applied as thermocouples to measure temperatures up to 2200 a degree Celsius. The high temperature stability, low vapor pressure, good wear resistance and ability to withstand arc corrosion of rhenium are useful in self-cleaning electrical contacts. In particular, the discharge occurring during the switching oxidizes the contacts. However, rhenium oxide Re207 has poor stability and therefore is removed during the discharge. Rhenium has a high melting point and a low vapor pressure similar to tantalum and tungsten. Therefore, rhenium filaments exhibit a higher stability if the filament is operated not in vacuum, but in oxygen-containing atmosphere. Those filaments are widely used in mass spectrometers, in ion gauges and in photoflash lamps in photography. Catalysts. Rhenium in the form of rhenium-platinum alloy is used as catalyst for catalytic reforming, 
which is a chemical process to convert petroleum refinery naphthas with low octane ratings into high octane liquid products. Worldwide, 30% of catalysts used for this process contain rhenium. The olefin metathesis is the other reaction for which rhenium is used as catalyst. Normally Re207 on alumina is used for this process. Rhenium catalysts are very resistant to chemical poisoning from nitrogen, sulfur and phosphorus, and so are used in certain kinds of hydrogenation reactions. Other uses, the isotopes 188Re and 186Re are radioactive and are used for treatment of liver cancer. They both have similar penetration depth in tissue, but 186Re has advantage of longer lifetime. 188Re is also being used experimentally in a novel treatment of pancreatic cancer where it is delivered by means of the bacterium Listerium inositogenes. Related by periodic trends, rhenium has a similar chemistry to that of technetium. Work done to label rhenium onto target compounds can often be translated to technetium. This is useful for radiopharmacy, where it is difficult to work with technetium a euro especially the 99M isotope used in medicine a euro due to its expense and short half-life. Precaution, very little is known about the toxicity of rhenium and its compounds because they are used in very small amounts. Soluble salts, such as the rhenium halides or perinates, could be hazardous due to elements other than rhenium or due to rhenium itself. Only a few compounds of rhenium have been tested for their acute toxicity. Two examples are potassium perinate and rhenium trichloride, which were injected as a solution into rats. The perinate had an LD50 value of 2800 a milligram per kilogram after seven days and the rhenium trichloride showed LD50 of 280 a milligram per kilogram. References External links, rhenium at the periodic table of videos.